Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel Study Hangout. Children, in a previous video, we learned about what is prime number and composite numbers. Yes. So today we are going to solve problem set 34, which is related to prime and a composite numbers. So let's start. Problem set 34. Question number one. Write all the prime numbers between 1 and 20. Now before writing the answer, let's first understand or recall because we have learned in a previous video that is what is prime number. So let's recall with what is prime number. A number which has only two factors, 1 and number itself is called a prime number. So prime numbers are in prime number we have only two numbers that is 1 which is common factor and the number itself is a prime number. So answer we have to write from 1 to 20 all the prime numbers. So prime numbers like 2 3, 5, 7, 11, 13, 17 and 19 are the prime numbers between one and twenty okay now let's move to question number two write all the composite numbers between 21 and 50 so before writing the answer let's recall what is composite number a number which has more than two factors is called a composite numbers means the number which has more factors, more than two factors, are called a composite numbers. And these composite numbers we have to write between 21 and 50. Okay, so answer. Numbers like 21, 22, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 30, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 38, 39, 40, 42, 44, 45, then 46, 48, 49 and the number itself 50 are the composite numbers between 21 and 50. Okay children, clear? Now let's move to question number 3. Circle the prime numbers in the list given below. The numbers are 22, 37, 43, 48, 53, 60, 91, 57, 59, 77, 79, 97, 100. Now in this question it is said that we have to circle the prime numbers which are given below. Okay, so the number 22 is the prime number children? No, it has more than two factors. So it is not a prime number. Then number 37? Yes, the number 37 is a prime number. 
to check it whether the 37 number is a prime or a composite number just divide 37 by 2 and if we are getting the remainder 0 that means this is a prime number so 2 ones are 2 3 minus 2 1 and this 7 take it down now in 2 table 17 is going no it is not going but 2 8s are 16 we can take so 2 8s are 16 7 minus 6 1 1 minus 1 0 here we got the remainder 1 so this is not a composite number this is a prime number okay so circle 37 as a prime number then number 43 is also a prime number because it is not divisible by 2 the remainder we will get the remainder 1 here so this also will be the prime number then number 48 no number 48 is a composite number then number 53 number 53 is a prime number so circle it on 53 then number 60 is a composite number then number 91 also is a composite number then 57 it is also a composite number it has more than two factors then 59 no it is not a composite number it is a prime number okay then number 77 it has more than two factors so it is not a prime number then number 79 is a prime number and the number 97 is also a prime number okay so we got the answer 37 43 53 59 79 and 97 are the prime numbers which we have circled it okay children now let's move to question number four which of the prime numbers are even number now here it is said that one number is there which is prime number and also a even number see in smaller class we have learned prime number and odd number and even number yes or no so here we have to see the which is the even number and also a prime number okay so first we have to write the prime number that is 2 3 then 5 11 19 are the prime numbers then even numbers are 2 4 6 8 10 are the even numbers yes or no so which is the common here 2 is the common number yes or no children so answer 2 is the only even number which is prime okay children clear so children i hope you must have understood problem set 34 so keep practicing and learning till then thank you and goodbye